Way to go. I like halibut, and I like halibut cheeks. Yeah. yeah I love halibut. Mm. Deep fried halibut, baked halibut, dried halibut. My mother fixed a lot of halibut, and and it, it's it's a favorite uh, of many people. I I particularly liked it, but I loved it uh, uh, fried, rolled in flour. And halibut, of course. You know, they were always. Uh, went out and fished those. And in the wintertime, Carlick River used to freeze over completely. And I remember when, uh, you know, they used to, uh, a lot of the men used to go out and cut a hole in the ice, go over there and, and spear fish through there and, and get flounder, eat a lot of flounder. And that was good too. Halibut is probably my universal fish. Um, I have dried it the, in the traditional way. Uh, Melissa Burns had a, a summer camp at the office one time and she helped everybody learn extensive amounts about preserving wild foods. And one of the things we made was the tumuk. And uh, we just seasoned the halibut and dried it in an emptied out smokehouse um, and just checked it till it, was, till it was dry. And it was really a truly amazing thing. We also did experimental batches in a dehydrator. And it worked really well. Um, the first batch, we completely overcooked it, but it was uh, like halibut chips. It was wonderful. And so we figured out that using a commercial dryer at the lowest temperature will produce a, a fairly similar product to the traditional dried halibut. And I use a food dehydrator now. I marinate mine. I make my own marinade, marinate them, and then put them in my food dehydrator. And people can do many things with it when you bake it, but I, I just make sure it's nice and clean, skinned. I, I like to take the skin off, and and uh, I put sour cream over the top and put uh, uh, season it. Put the sour cream and uh, bacon bits and sprinkle some shredded cheese on the top, and it goes in the oven for about a half hour. It's a it's a simple meal, of course, depending on the thickness of it. And you use all parts of it too, which is not being used anymore. So much, you know, is being taken. And I think that the earth will only take so much and then revolt, you know, she'll get mad. <laughs> so, and we need to, I think, have more respect, you know, more respect for the earth and for what she provides. Come in, queen, and the piano.